The Contact Form 7 spam quizzes stop spam messages in their tracks. These quizzes are easy to set up and can be on any topic that you want. You're going to learn how it all works in this video. Hi, I'm Bjorn from WP Learning Lab. Now let's get started. The super simple method to prevent spam is right down here. I filled in the form and there is a question. I'm going to answer it incorrectly. The correct answer will be 16, by the way. Click on Submit and it says the quiz answer is incorrect. One or more fields have an error. Please try again. Let's try 15. Nope, still not right. Let's try 16. And message has been sent. That's great. And I also, when you receive the message, I do not have it set to receive the answer. You can if you want to, but you already know what the answer is, and the point is not to have it added to the email itself, but you can if you want to. I'm going to show you how to add this to your form, plus other variations of it. Let's go to the dashboard. Let's go to contact. This is the form right here that I added that math quiz to. There it is right there. And this looks pretty confusing, um, but you can just type this out exactly how it is and have this form field on your site or make one from scratch. Let's delete that. Let's click on quiz. Let's call this anti-spam math, just like we had a moment ago. Here's an example of how to do it. So you don't have to memorize what you're seeing here. Just look at the example they have below the form. Let's type in 12 plus 67, question mark, pipe character, and then the answer, which is 79. And then click on insert tag. You can also have more than one. Let's do um, five plus six, question mark, pipe character, 11. They're getting easier and easier as I go. Click on insert tag. Now it has all of those inserted and it's going to pick one of them at random. So if I save this, go back out to our site, go to the contact page, 12 plus 67. Now if I refresh, 5 plus 6, refresh again. 12 plus 67, refresh again, 5 plus 6, 2 plus 1. So at random, it chooses whatever the quiz is that you entered here. And you can have as many as you want. You can also have something else. Common example, anti-spam capitals. What is the capital of France? Question mark, pipe character, Paris. New line. Let's make this feel a little bigger so we can see these are all separate lines. It won't let me do it. Usually Chrome lets me extend, extend fields sideways too. Anyway, you get the idea. One per line. Berlin. It's the capital of Mars. Mars base one. All right. Insert tag. Save, refresh, and we see a new question. And they have to give the answer that was after the pipe character. The one for Germany and France, most people should be able to get that one. But the question about the capital of Mars being Mars base one is the answer. People might not get that. And I keep refreshing, but France is the only one showing up here. Germany, let's go Mars. Where is it? There it is. So you have to have the correct answer to have the email sent. And that's a really simple way to have anti-spam protection on your contact form 7 forms. There are a host of other ways. I have tutorials for each of them that I'll link to in the description down below if they're completed already. But any one of these methods will work, but you can also combine them all to have super protection on your contact forms. And while you're here, I thought you might want to know about the completely free ultimate 17 point WordPress launch checklist. It is a checklist, a detailed checklist of all the things that you need to do or should do before you launch a WordPress site written by me, someone who's launched thousands of websites over the years. This is a checklist I created almost 10 years ago and it's been downloaded at least 100,000 times. I haven't checked the stats lately, but it was over 100,000 a few months ago. It is a checklist of what you go through before you launch a website. And there's two versions of it. There's this version here. It includes videos and includes links to other resources. So it really takes you through the steps you need to take to launch your website. 
in a nice format like you see here. And we also have a print friendly version over here. So you can print it off. And this is a smart PDF. That means it will adjust to the size of your screen. For example, if you're on iPhone 12 Pro, see how it all adjusts to fit the smaller screen? It messes up the WordPress and the title up here. But everything else, it goes down to the smaller screen. What if you have a Galaxy Fold? It'll look like this. Or at least pretty close to what this is. Unlike other PDFs that don't shrink, that are a real pain to look at when they're shrunk down. And the, the uh, print-friendly version works the same way if you want just black and white. And they're also downloadable. Click on the little download button and you download the PDF to your computer. The benefit of the smart PDF as well is when I update it, you will get the updates instantly. So you can get this just by opting in with your name and email address on the page that I've linked to in the description down below. You get this totally for free. And when you download it, you'll have the current version of it. But then if I update it in the future, this smart PDF at this URL will be updated with the new content that you can come back and download it again. So I recommend when you opt in that you bookmark this page so you can save it for future reference. And every few months, I don't update it every week, but every few months or so, come in here, check if there's some changes, download the new version, and you're good to go. So if you want to join over 100,000 fellow WordPress users and get this PDF checklist for yourself, do so now. There's a link down in the description. All you have to do is enter your name and email, and I will send you emails. Most of those emails are just about videos I've published on my various channels. Sometimes I send you offers for stuff you might be interested in, mostly uh, WordPress courses and stuff that I offer myself. And it's no big deal. You can unsubscribe at any time and then keep this checklist forever anyway. Page, on there you enter your name and email, and I will send you the PDF in your email. And it also takes you to a thank you page after you opt in where you can download it and access it directly from that page. If you want yet another way to stop spam messages being sent through contact form seven, then this video right up here is going to be for you. In it, you're going to learn how to set up the Akismet plugin, which is specifically designed to stop spam. So check out that video. It's okay. I'll wait. I'll be waiting right up here. Click on that. You'll see me again. Click right there.